Matt Rizzo, of course, everybody's drinking, right? So, you know, that's what it, what, how it is. And uh, Rizzo's down there. We're all down there at the hot tub. And uh, Rizzo kind of leads on that he feels like he put hands on on uh, Danger. Like, he, he was beating him in the exchanges. Basically said he pieced him up. And uh, Jamie being boys with Danger, of course, he's going to tell him. Rizzo came up, and he 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 called Jamie a rat, which... I don't necessarily agree with because he wasn't like saying anything that that wasn't said or or you know Rizzo should be able to tell that to Danger's face if he's gonna if he's gonna say it and he, and he didn't. What you guys didn't see was uh, uh, Tim Elliott's in the corner, kind of like uh, antagonizing the whole thing, like sitting back there laughing, like saying little things here and there, and he wants to see something jump off, you know. Anytime I've seen on TV like. People both start to fight. I'm like, man, if they want to fight, just let them fight, you know? Just at least let them fight if they want to fight. But then when you're there, you realize that, all right, this is this is my boy. This is my teammate. I don't want him to, to do something that gets him kicked off the show. It just felt right to jump in and make sure that uh, things didn't get too out of control. They pushed a little bit, but, you know, we, I don't think we we're going to let anything happen, so. I don't think that there's ever been a, a Ultimate Fighter where in the ult- elimination round, that every fight ends in a finish. Sure, it's like a really big sense of pride for us, not only to put on good fights. Of course, we all wanted to finish, and once the finishes started happening, we all, you know, wanted to make sure that kept going. And once it got going, yeah, guys, guys are really behind, just really pushing it. Everybody's going out there, just really pushing for the finish, pushing to put on great fights. Also, this episode we saw uh, the coaches' challenge didn't go so well for Cejudo. Oh, my gosh, so <laughs> frustrating to. Because I'm, I know how to golf, right? Oh, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty decent at golf, so I try to take Henry aside. For someone to be so high-caliber athletic and not be able to uh, hit the golf ball, you know, one, it's frustrating, um, but two, golf is a completely different thing. It's so different. You know, your swing has to be right, and your hand-eye coordination is different. But, you know, I tried to pull him aside and, and, and show him. But if you don't, if you've never golfed before and, you know, you think you're going to take somebody and tell them, hey, do this or do this, do this, and go out there and it's going to happen, it's not going to happen. Some people got rubbed the wrong way because he was kind of laughing the whole time. But, you know, what are you going to do? Like, if you don't know how to golf, you don't know how to golf. So I don't really hold it against him. Um, I know some of the other guys might hold it against him a little more, but it was what it was. It's probably because the whole $1,500 per fighter that you right. guys could have had, exactly. uh, it's what they're holding think, against him. I think some of us on on, uh, on Team Cejudo are uh, – I'm kind of worried about maybe Joe had golf before. Maybe he might have known what was up or what was coming. You know, I don't know. I heard he, I heard he did some top golf before, so I don't know. It appears that you will be the second fight of the next uh, phase of the competition. What kind of things do have you taken away from uh, staring, staring off with him at this point and getting your you, mindset for the fight? It was a completely different stare down experience between him and Demacio. Like, like I said, Demacio's eyes like pierce you. They look to your soul, but. But when I stared off with Hiromasa, I couldn't get a read on him. It was like, I almost felt like he wanted to smile a little bit, you know? And I'm trying to, I'm, I'm sitting here kind of like trying to be stone, stone cold face and, and intense. And uh, he just has this blank look on his face. So I couldn't really pull much out of him on that, but uh, it, did, it, it didn't matter. He's there to compete. I know he's going to bring it and uh, I'm going to do the same. So, yeah.